online and alternative dispute resolution. How do we ensure that consumers can pursue their rights in the digital single market? In 2010, 40% of all European consumers shopped online, but only 9% shopped in an internet store from another EU country. Of these international shoppers, 20% experienced some kind of difficulty with their transaction. According to the European Commission, the overall gain for consumers would be around 204 billion euros if e-commerce reached 15% of retail sales and if the obstacles to the single market were removed. Sina Schmidt, manager of the Danish ECC office, believes that many consumers don't know how protected they are or how they should go about making a complaint. You actually have quite a few rights as a consumer within the EU today. The problem is not the rights, the problem is how to pursue those rights in another member state. I think one of the main barriers for consumers when they want to trade or shop online cross-border is the lack of trust and confidence. Morten Frederik Norvell Lassen lives in Denmark with his wife and two children. He likes to shop online, but unfortunately he has experienced problems, most recently when he bought a pair of shoes for his wife that never arrived. For me it wasn't clear exactly how I should handle the situation. I remember I browsed the internet, but I couldn't really figure out exactly what I was supposed to do. It wasn't clear exactly what my options were, so I ended up just not doing anything. I think one of the things that could be done to increase the trust and confidence when consumers trade cross-border is uh, making it easy and accessible for the consumer to pursue their rights in another member state. I still shop online in other countries, I definitely do, but it has to be on pages where I have a certain degree of trust. I would definitely feel more secure if I knew exactly what my rights were when I buy things online from other countries within the EU. How do we ensure that consumers can pursue their rights in the digital single market?